This is 50 ways to kill the warden in Minecraft. From taming 1,000 bees to blowing up a nuke in the deep dark. Starting with, that's right, healing potions. This seems really weird, but I believe we need 32. And this is the easiest way to kill a warden. But by the end of this video, you're going to see some of the most extreme things I didn't even think was possible in Minecraft. Throughout this entire video, we're gonna be using the- oh, What? I didn't think that you could actually kill him with potions of healing. Would you believe me if I told you you could kill a warden with a fishing rod? You have to wait until the hook sinks deep enough in your hole. That's what she said. Hooks the warden and then yoink, yoink him. Wow, I can't, yoink. does this really work? There's no way this works. <gasps> he died! What about a YouTuber, specifically Canman18? Preston, I can't do this! Ah! Ooh, maybe not. How about a thousand wolves against the warden? That's a lot of wolves. Now we're gonna spawn the warden, remove the wall, go! Oh my god! Oh my, dude, this is crazy. Okay, uh, eventually some- <gasps> The wolves prevailed! Even more intense, the blood golem. This light will summon him. And this command block. Oh no, dude. I don't- there's no chance. The size difference between these two monsters is incredible. TNT minecarts, when you have a bunch of TNT minecarts, is the explosion gonna be enough to kill the warden? Well, apparently it is! If you have 24 minecarts crammed in a tiny area, it's supposed to kill the warden. I mean, it's gonna take a while, right? It's just, it's just... What? A lightsaber. Oh yeah, baby! How you like those sound effects? Yeah, I know you like that warden! Yeah! Did I just melt him? Since one cam man didn't work, what about a hundred of them? Oh my <laughs> They keep squeezing him from corner to corner. There are strength in numbers, ladies and gentlemen. Now we try anvils. Let's just, uh, okay. They're just pounding this guy. <laughs> that wasn't even that many. What about a stray versus a warden? We're gonna spawn the stray first. We're gonna give him a speed two potion. Oh, don't kill me. And then we're gonna spawn the warden and see what happens. Giving a stray archer a speed two potion allows him to dodge the warden. So eventually, after enough arrows, he's supposed to die. What did I just witness? Lightning. This is probably my favorite way that we're gonna try to kill the warden. Uh, speaking of electricity, it would be fantastic if you could just charge that like button up down below. Uh, you know, I thought that was a great moment in time to ask for people to like the video. Oh, he needs oh. some big booty. How about a tree? There we go, right over here, right over the tree. Oh, commence plan suffocation! Yes! Oh my gosh, that was so hard. Freezing. What's that, Warden? We just launched a new Spooktober merch collection inspired by all things spooky, scary, and of course, my family. You can get all five of these tees on FireMerch.com or the brand new FireMerch app available on iOS and Android. These new t-shirts are so scary that they're available for only a limited time, so please get them before they're gone forever. <laughs> It's a tipping offer, to be honest. A puffer fish army. So we've got a bunch of puffer fish down here. Yeah, that's right. Puff him. Puff the yes. Get puffed, warden. Uh, a warden. You heard me right. We're gonna make two wardens fight and see which one wins. All right, my money is on this one on the right. Oh no, I've lost track. Which one is which? Dude, these two wardens are evenly matched, but the one on the right loses. The warden's gonna spawn on this emerald block. So I'm gonna put one portal here, and then we're gonna put another portal up here, so that way he falls to his death. Oh gosh, please. Oh! <laughs> what about deleting him from Minecraft? I'm in my Minecraft folder right now. There's a readme text that says, do not under any circumstances edit or remove any of the files in the game files folder. This could lead to some bad consequences. So obviously, you know we have to go to the Entities folder and then start looking for the Warden. Warden, it's been nice knowing you, buddy. Three, two, one, Delito, Spuckito. Iron Golem. Now, I just don't think Iron Golems are gonna be strong enough to take out a Warden, but we're gonna try. Or rather, he's gonna try, and he's, he's he failed miserably. But if I spawn five of them and buff them with potions, they might be able to win. So I'm, I'm gonna kill the Warden for now, spawn in five Golems, and I'm gonna buff these guys up with speed potions, strength potions, and regeneration. Now we spawn the Warden. Go, my dudes, go! Oh my, the Warden's not even fighting back. This is literally what happens when the school bullies get bullied. Let's go! Maybe that's too dark because technically he killed them and maybe we shouldn't say that. I don't know. Using only one punch. This is a netherite sword with strength 100 and if we crit, we can one punch him. <laughs> Using a fully enchanted bow. Oh, dude. Oh, whoa, whoa. A little premature there, my guy. All right, warden is spawned. Okay, now this is just unfair to the warden. 
Just to show you how sad this is, I'm gonna start recording on this phone and walk around my office. All right, I have no idea if the warden's dead. Um, you guys are in my office with me. I am literally just doing this. For all we know, he could be dead by now. I'm gonna check. All we have to do, and he just died, <laughs> what? And just for fun, how fast does it take 100 withers to kill one warden? I mean, come on, you guys have to be a little bit curious. That's 50, that's 75, and that is 100, ladies and gentlemen. I've never seen this. It looks like this dark cloud that's looming above the warden. This is, this is insane. Yes! Using a sand trap. So the warden's been spawned. This is it. Oh, dude. Oh, here he comes. Here he comes. Wait for the moment. Wait for the moment. <gasps> Wait for it. Yes! Ah, dude, if only I could trap my wife in one of these. So 911. Using snow, because apparently the warden is allergic. Similar to how Superman is allergic to Kryptonite. It's an oversimplification, but yeah. Oh, he moves really slow. Oh, that's weird. As you can see, the snow does no damage to me, but he's slowly dying. Oh! End crystals. This is gonna be interesting. Similar to these end crystals, please explode on that subscribe button. Thank you so much. Uh, oh, it only took three. What about TNT? This is kind of like how many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Roll Pop? But instead, it's how many TNT blocks it takes to kill the warden. We're at three. This is four, five, six, seven. Oh, he's living. Eight. Eight TNT blocks is all it takes to kill the warden. Cobweb trap. We're gonna spawn the warden again, and now we've gotta lure him to the cobweb trap before he eliminates us. Oh no, wait, I forgot where I put the cobweb trap again, but it's good because the llamas are here. Uh, okay, please, can we remember where this cobweb trap is? Oh, I, I found it. Okay, he's really angry now. Uh, I'm gonna go this way, oh God. And get him. And then we go down, and look at this. He's stuck in the cobwebs like a big idiot. L he's so big, he's actually huge. Now we gotta take advantage of some of the new blocks in Minecraft. We're gonna use dripstones. Okay, so Warden spawned. Now we drop the dripstones. Let it drip, baby. Let it, yeah! 1,000 bees. I know I mentioned this in the intro of the video, so you've all been patiently waiting. It's time to spawn the Warden as well as the bees. Oh my goodness. See, none of this would have happened if the Warden could just mine his own beesness. We wouldn't have to put him through these types of situations. But the Warden, unfortunately, likes to just bully individuals like myself and other beginner Minecraft players, and we won't stand for it. Water. Yes, we are going to defeat this Warden using literally water. He almost killed us just there. The Warden, if you didn't know, is hydrophobic. That's a fancy word for meaning he's afraid of water. So his pathing, <laughs> he just can't like go into water. Um, oh, by the way, this is a power 1000 bow. Let me demonstrate. Very powerful. In fact, I can just you, 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 you. Choking up my own jokes. A grenade. Now these are custom grenades. So when you throw them, they explode in a five by five radius. Let's just pretend like the U.S. military needs to take out one of these bad boys. How many grenades is it going to take? We're at five grenades. That's nine. All right, how about we just start chucking? Dear goodness gracious of gravy babies. That was like 35 grenades. I guess the warden really is the bomb. I wanted to see if we can make one really big grenade and I'm gonna throw one really big grenade at him and see if it works. What? You gotta be kidding me. Seriously? Four, I, what? Magma blocks. This might take an actual lifetime to accomplish, but we're gonna do it. Instead of luring him this time, I've got a bow with punch and I'm going to literally yoink him into that little hole. Yes, and now we wait. Oh, that was actually a lot faster than I thought it was gonna be. The infinity gauntlet. And yes, later we're gonna test out the lightsaber. It has 82 attack damage, but for now, Reality can be whatever I want it to be. Yeah, I'm going to avenge all of the Minecraft players you have defeated. Three, two, one, punch it! What? Um, let's try that again. I am going to snap you out of this box. If it's the last thing I do, buddy. Where'd he go, where'd he go? Where'd he go, anybody seen him? Anybody seen a warden? No, I genuinely think we snapped him from reality. <laughs> so obviously we're in the end and we're going to spawn beds and we're gonna see how many of them it takes to kill the buddy. Oh, this looks like a good spot. Oh, that's one. 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Holy guacamole! He took like 15 beds to die. The void. We're in the deep dark right now, and we've gone all the way down the bedrock. And this right here will break bedrock, okay? It's very, very precise timing. We're gonna get, oh gosh, it's weird. I've got this new thing on. And then we hold the control, and it worked! Let's go! I think the warden can fit through this. Oh, I just don't know if he's gonna walk in, dude. We might have to push him in. <gasps> Yo! Get in the hole. Get in the hole. How are you not in that hole? Oh, yes! <laughs> giant zombies. This is something I never thought we'd be able to test. But are three giant zombies enough to defeat the wardster? Come on, warden. These are just big zombies. Oh my gosh, I think the warden's going to lose. I never thought I would say, the warden lost to zombies. TNT cannon. This is something we have not used in a very long time, but there should be a warden in that hole. Now, this is some ridiculously overpowered TNT, so as long as he goes in the hole, it's going to one-shot him. Oh, yeah. Oh, baby. Literally direct impact. Natural disasters. Specifically, a tornado. Now, we get a lot of these in Texas. They are extremely deadly. Honestly, so is the warden. He's stuck up in the tornado. All right, now we're gonna delete the tornado. Oh. <laughs> Let's go. A dripstone cannon. Now, we used dripstone that fell from the sky on top of the warden to kill him. But what about turning it into a projectile? Oh, wait, it goes right here in front of the observer. Yeah, get him, buddy. Oh my gosh, this is the best thing I've ever seen in my entire life. This is so funny. Oh, wait, it's that much damage? A giant meteor. I've been waiting all video for this one, man. I promise there is a meteor that is coming. <laughs> Using a command. It works. His girlfriend. The warden is a very romantic individual. In fact, maybe a little too romantic. This right here spawns the warden's girlfriend. As you can see, she is gorgeous. The warden is so romantic, he frequently he takes his girlfriend to five-star restaurants with bills of $500 or more. Now, this is gonna sound really mean, but I have to kill her. I'm sorry! He's crying. Is that what that is? Oh my God. All right, next clip. <laughs> trick shotting. We're gonna spawn this warden in, shoot him into the stream, and while he's at the top, trick shot him. It's so stupid, but so good. A nuclear explosion. This is the warden nuke, okay? I mean, look at how big this thing is. We gotta summon the warden, gently place the nuke. Oh my gosh. But to ignite this bad boy, you can't just use a flint and seal. You actually have to use soul campfires. Assuming everything goes well, which... Oh no. 